Ladies and gentlemen, hello and welcome back to Daemon Blackfire of the Iron Throne, the Black Dragon who rules Westeros. So last time we did defeat our brother, we were extremely lucky, captured him in battle, but the truth is I was going to defeat him twice. Yeah, I did defeat him twice, I just wanted to wait and see what happened, but uh, yeah. So. We're now kings of the Iron Throne, with some degree of luck, shall we say. We did ally ourselves to the Baratheons, the Nord. Failed to become our ally. If my daughter died, I can't actually remember why... Okay, I see. No, I don't. Anyway, we're heading north to the Eyrie because the Arons were the only ones we didn't like as the lords. We did judge everyone fairly, well, kind of fairly. The Tullys were the first to fall. I decided against taking their title. Then I headed south. Well, the most powerful houses. Lord Aaron Tyrell stopped forward. He refused as well. I say as well because uh, the Danes refused just uh, prior to that. Where's the Lord of Harrowhound? I do remember this guy. Lodson. Oh yeah, look at that. He's a torturer. This is so cool. I like torturers. Greatest Knights. Sand Dornish Organizer, that guy is an amazing choice. Sir Rion, step forward. Bow, and thus my sword touch his shoulder. He bowed as a man and rise as a king's guard. And he's happy. Yay! Oh. Now that we're kings, well, it's an empire title, believe it or not. I'm going to send this guy, where is he? Where's our new newest king's guard? Oh, how many troops do you have, dude? 10,000. Oh, yeah, I don't need to raise any more troops. Also, the Golden Company did not uh, raise. I. I actually assume that maybe they will form something like an equivalent to the Golden Armada or something like that. Oh, uh, we have another person. Hmm. And our organizer seems like a good idea. We need someone honorable. He's zealous and just. Well, just he's a pretty good trait, so maybe him. And this guy, he's attractive and strong and. He's rude and a craven. We don't need people like him. Sir Breer, step forward. I name you Knight of the Realm. Take your vows, take your cloak, and rise as a king's guard. Take up arms and defend me. Who are you? Oh, Awain. Oh, the Tullys. The Tullys failed to answer the call to arms. We will remember that, Tully. Lord Durham Crosby's treason is one thing, but that uh, Corey stands beside the Iron Throne, carrying the very sword sworn to defend your wife. Can such a knight be trusted to honor his vows before you? He's honest, kind, erude, lustful. Um, he's married. He's knight of the King's Guard. He will do his duty. Defending against the Pope. Funny. And I've gained just. Alright. Hey, I want to sh shave my head a little bit. Not to be bored, mind you. Oh, come on, don't black. 
There you go. I look exactly like my brother. I'm not gonna grant you Blackfire, my friend. Is that mountains? It's hills. This is mountains. Where is he actually? Um. Oh, okay, he's in the Eerie right now. And my child became patient. That's very good. Thank you, Maester. And does the Black Dragon take the Eerie? We propose that Lord Arryn gets married to this one. She's a Kingslander. She's nothing special, so I do agree. How's my council looking? I do think we will get some great councillors like you, for example. Do you have a wife? You do. That's nice. Do you? Master at Arms. His guy needs a wife. Here's a Targaryen. She's attractive, so... Not gonna be matrilineal. Okay, who next? Master the Coin. Very cool. Master of the Whispers. Yo, Shallow Master. Congratulations. Maester and Septon. We cannot afford to grant myself a coronation while still wars reign in the realm. That's a lot of attrition. Oh, I need a new ambition. Well, I want to win the war. We'll go for a dragon eggs after that. Request coronation. That will be after the civil war has ended. Um, soulmates. Yeah, King's Landing should be mine, right? You're standing there, not doing much. You have 30,000 troops, give or take. Move there. Oh, um... Okay. I have 90 ships as personal... Ships. Well, okay. Can we split you in half? We do. We can. Ooh, wow. That's a pirate there that we defeated, wasn't it? We can split you in half as well. Well, good. I hate waiting on other people. Take the fight to them. Okay. Now if I execute you... Yeah, that's a tyrannical thing to do. 305 ships. All together now. Split in half and... You guys go on the boat. War has come to your door, my friend. There is nothing you can do about it. Go to the fingers. From there... This belongs to the king. <laughs> Never thought of that, but whatever. Oh! Hmm. You want me to be merciful. What should I do with you? Let him rot for now. We still need to go in for a trial, I think. Yeah, I hear something funny. There is no way out now. 
peasant revolt. How dare you, sir? The realm is instead of war, and you dare raise your troops against me? The Martels will take care of you. So, why are we suffering so much attrition here? 12% maximum attrition in province. Supply limit 10,000. Total troops in province 12. Um. Okay. So if I assault this. Stop that. Yes. Wow. And just remain there, I guess, but don't do that again, please. Oh, and there are the Baratheons coming our way. Speaking of uh, cool stuff, I am going to lead this army because teleportation works. Okay, I actually want to assign my... Uh... Hmm. Martel, you... Oh, you're there. My mother will become a good commander. And this guy, sure. So I'm gonna have you leading the secondary army. Actually, it's the Martel that will be leading this army. And while he was traveling here, he picked up this lord, and my mother is not going to come with him. Instead, I'm gonna have my courtier, this guy. Are you married, dude? No. Well, here. That's the woman with the highest marshal. You're no longer my spy master, eh? What the hell happened? Owen abdicated without leaving any blood relatives as clear heir to the High Lordship of Skagos. Therefore, it falls to you to settle the inheritance in Skagos. Well. Skagos shall revert to the king. <laughs> okay. So Skagos war has uh, ended, it seems. You have a living heir. So what do you mean no clear heir? What's the succession, Lethic Cognitic Primogeniture. Primogeniture? Um, if I'm not mistaken... Yeah, the oldest child should take this. I think it's a glitch. Sure, it's his. He can have it for now. Yeah, the Martel wasn't the best choice here. Dude, flank, 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 flank him! You. Oh, can't believe you did something so stupid, man! Well, the reeds picked up arms against us, so they're thankful for letting them be. What happened? Yeah, this was uh, your defeat. You may blame the Martels because they led the army, but it was all your fault for our defeat here. To the Great King, Captain Edmur of the Hedge Knights, initially our previous employer, to provide our ready pay. Uh, so you became part of us. I don't need mercenaries, but they, yeah, I don't think you have anyone else. Okay. So, how far are you going to run? This is a land territory, led by the Belmores. Oh, the Belmores are going to inherit the, the Eerie and the Vale, it seems, so...
Grace I honor my allegiance, take up arms to defend you. So this guy actually. Uh excellent. And thus a small rebellion here. You stop reading my letters, people. It's not nice. Not nice at all. So what do we have? Battles minus three percent. Occupations. We have an occupation, I didn't know that. Well, good to know. Can I banish you to the wall? I can execute you. Well, think about it. For now, we're fine. Oh, I guess we won the war, but whatever. Obtain a dragon egg. Yes, I want to obtain a dragon egg. Um, who has imprisoned you? Captain Anger of Hedge Knights. Hedge Knights, people. I was just joking, I really want uh, you to work for me. <laughs> yeah, we can't afford them. Hmm. So if I click on this uh, fool, oh, uh, yeah, I totally forgot that you existed. Ah, the candles. Oh, th are the Templars fighting against me? No, they're fighting against the Arons. I'm still not the scientist. Actually, I can't give it to the uh, these guys, the Wayne Woods. Or oh, think about it. Oh no, this guy died. No one cared about you. Um, it seems like the Templetons are my enemies for some reason. Against the tyranny of Kingdom now of a uh, mountain bay or something. Okay, move in. <laughs> yeah, look at that. And what are you fighting for? Against the tyranny of this guy again? Excellent. So, um... Well, it's going to be the Belmores. They did not join me, but uh, they are not fighting against me, I guess. Unlike the rest of the scum. Who just saw an opportunity and decided to go there. This guy has taken up arms. Well, aren't you all noble, Umber? What the hell are you doing there? And um, and we captured someone. Ah, this guy. And thus, this castle's mine now. Isn't that nice? Now, wait here, just not uh, that long from now. Excellent. So, um, because the Tyrells did not join, you decide it's uh, your opportune time to. No, wait. What the hell's going on here? Because they're dying. Okay, then. Young Aegon is showing strong tendencies towards her prideful behavior, so you can become ambitious. My boy, ambition is uh, right for you. Oh my lord. What kind of disease is that? Great plague. Great sickness has taken hold of this province. This devastating plague does not care for status. C kills people highborn or low. Alas and alack, the plague has arrived. <coughs> Dragon. 
try that plague. Ah, oh, yes, I wanted to see what it does. Minus seven health. I think I'll go north for the summer. Just until the plague goes down. And I've inherited stuff from this guy. Um. Hmm. Sir Andosko died without leaving a blood relative as clear heir to the castle of Dragon Gale. Dragon Gale. That's this castle. Not this King's Gate. City of King's Landing. Weird. Hmm. It shall revert to the King. Kind of uh, weird. So it was this one? Yeah. Soldiers, man. Always lovely. Hmm. Private farms? Yeah, sure, let's build. I mean, we have money. We have it. And. <laughs> yeah, no, dude. Don't bother me with that. We have plans for those lands. I'm educating my child. It's not educated by this guy. I will educate this one as well. Hmm. That will help a lot. At least two of them must survive. There are no dragons here, right? Oh, yeah, take a squire. Make wildfire run some prisoners. What happened to your dad, dude? I died in my dungeons. Because he was wounded, you see. Hmm. Yeah, you will pay for him. I mean, that's the blood of Targaryens for 10 gold. It's a bargain. So, ladies and gentlemen, I'm gonna take a break here and I'll see you all next time. Goodbye.